Well, it is time for the final of this junior tournament matched at 59 kilograms. And via two good semi-finals, we now have the final of Joe Turner and Josh Breslin. It's Shin Kick and Team Chaos head-to-head -head here at the Royal Combat League. 500 pound winning prize and we are sponsored by Heronsley Group. It's Luxury Developments. Josh Breslin beat David Portacci from Italy. And Joe Turner beat Zach Jabira in two semi-finals. And here we are. Everything to play for for these young juniors, Alex. Yeah, it's a fast start to the fight as well, Danny. Both these juniors fighting under pro-am rules, able to use the elbows, as you can see there. This is uh, shaping up to be a really good final. Breslin already trying to initiate that elbow. And try and spike it as he comes forward. Pulls 12 to 6 o'clock elbows. Totally legal in Muay Thai, Alex. Yeah, they are the legal in Muay Thai. Um, although they're not permitted in, in other sports like MMA, we, we do accept them rules in, in Muay Thai here in the UK. Breslin's backing up Turner. Turner is a very, very talented kid. I know he's a uh, coach, Jesse Saunders. He's one of the golden boys of Shin Kick. He trains very hard and always seems to be there. Definitely got his heart and soul in it, hasn't he? Yeah, he's, he's, a, he's a great kid, Joe Turner. I've seen him fight a few times here on Raw Combat. And, um, you know, you would have had him down probably his tournament favourite before this started today. Breslin is uh, trying to answer that because he started very, very lively. And, uh, got a very good hold in the clinch there and manages to score a couple of good knees. And again... Now that's good clinch work from both these young lads, isn't it? With really good knees. Yeah, both both these young boys are actually demonstrating how to how to use the clinch really well. We're all gonna need a more lively start from Turner. I think they expect a bit more aggression out of him this round, would you say? Yeah, I've, I've noticed that he, he, um, when um, when he catches the kick, there's a brilliant defence there by Bre uh, by Breslin. There's two or three times Turner's tried to catch the kick and, and the defence from Breslin's been great, but the hands from Turner at the moment are looking really, really strong. Going to be his best weapon, I think, by the looks of it. Good off-balance from Turner there. He scored the knee, put his opponent to the floor. Good point scorer. Starting to show what he's made of. And again, it's good clinch work from both these guys. The knees are scoring clean knees straight into the ribs and they're both wearing them well. Yeah, some really good clinch work. We've, um, I do like to see these young lads using. Oh, well, it was just a slip there by Turner. But I do like to see these young lads using the full full rules and uh, some really good work there by Breslin, working the body and then coming back up top with the elbows as we go back into clinch again. Two real Muay Thai kids these are. I can tell you got you got your kickboxers and you got your tie fighters, but these two boys, they will bleed Muay Thai. Would you say that, Alex? Yeah, both these young lads, you can tell, they train proper Muay Thai, they, they really they do it for the love of the sport, you know, and uh, today hopefully one of, them will, one of them will walk away with £500. Good pocket money at that age, I'll tell you what, it was £7 for my paper round when I was a kid, Alex, £500 and a nice title to your name, it's a good day's work, isn't it? Yeah, probably. You know what, I really like the work by Breslin, up and down, body and head, boxing elbow, closing the distance, straight into clinch where he can be effective, some really good work there by Breslin. I think uh, I think Joe's much more effective on the outside of him, honest, leading off that backhand. Totally agree with you, and at the, the, I'll tell you what, Breslin is the Breslin here, he is setting up those elbows a lot better than Turner, he, he, looks, like, he looks like he's more fluent in the elbow. Well, third round and a lively start from both fighters who know what they've got to do. Good kick from Turner as he stepped in there, straight across the ribs, but the knees from Breslin are superb. A really good clincher. I know Turner's a great clincher as well and matching him a lot of the time, but I just think Breslin's just got you the edge on him with those knees, do you? Yeah, I think the height in clinch is actually helping him. He's able to, he's able to manipulate the clinch a little better. I think... The start of the round, the two of them coming in with some snappy, snappy work. The, the right hand left up from Breslin. 
and then the lead left hand from the south post stance into that lovely left kick of Turner. I think he needs to move his feet a bit more and stay out of the clinch because Breslin's dominating when it's in the clinch. Also scoring well though. Every time I just think Breslin's just getting ahead, Turner scores something back and brings it close again. It's another good exchange here and this is some of the best clinching you're going to see from kids of this age. Yeah, you see, but there's two or three unanswered knees there from Turner. He's, he's allowing Breslin to get his knees off. As Sean Boland, our referee for the night, breaks the clinch. Lovely combination work, right hand into that lead, spear and right elbow from Breslin. Again, unanswered knees, unanswered knees in the clinch um, from, from Breslin. I think um, I think Turner needs to move his feet and stay on the outside and work that southpaw and, and create more angles and use, his, use the left kick that he's got a really good job of doing. Shin kick, of course. Shin kick, my tight, and Team Chaos head to head here. Turner tries to land the elbows, but it's not easy when someone's got the inside of the clinch, is it? No, it's not. And he's, he's setting it up so well. That straight right, left up to the body, and then coming in with the spear and right elbow. He's completely dominating Turner in the clinch, if you ask me. And I think if it stays like this, Breslin's going to take this 500 pound tournament. Turner trying to answer him back now. He's now put his back on the ropes, which is. Something he's been a little bit bullied for me, Joe Turner, at times. That's where Turner needs to be, on the outside, spear in the left hand. I think, um, I do think he's got it. I think Breslin's got this. Award-winning developers of prestigious, beautiful, no-hosing 